fight. This is the moment that every mixed martial arts athlete hopes will materialize. The number one heavyweight contender making the walk for his first title fight here in the U.S. I mean, the nerves are going crazy for this man right now. He's so nervous. Has he done everything he needs to do? Has he not left any stone unturned? He says that he has prepared. He says that his body's ready. His mind's ready. He feels physically good in the spot. He's taking on a long-rated champion. If he's gonna get this done, it's gonna take something truly special. He does not believe jitters will be a factor here tonight. He has built his career methodically to this point. We'll see if we hear the words and new by night 10. respect and appreciation as we have for the skill sets of the lower weight class athletes there is nothing in pro sports quite like a ufc heavyweight championship fight that is a reality you've been there you've done that baddest man on the planet putting that very distinction on the line tonight yeah the champ walks again and he wears that proudly johnny wants to be called the champ he loves to be called the baddest man on the planet he is so skilled he's so dangerous he's so scary and he gets up for these types of challenges. He intends to never let go of his belt. He understands the challenge in front of him here tonight, but he has been forged by this training camp, the championship experience he has accrued, and we'll see if he can lead the way he enters as the greatest heavyweight in the world. Our tale of the tape for this heavyweight championship fight. To get us started with the official introductions, here is Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. <laughs> Championship of the world. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner, presenting the challenger, Vicious. And now introducing the champion, fighting out of the red corner, presenting the reigning, defending, undisputed UFC heavyweight champion of the world, Diesel. Herb Dean, third man in the octagon tonight. Scheduled for five rounds if need be. I mean, the hand speed just absurd. Now lands a kick to the body. Huge block there. Straight right hand, no good. Oh, nice inside leg kick, yeah. Looking for that left hand, not there. Man, they are trading early and often. Here we go. Let's go. This is going to be a good fight. We knew it would. These guys are intent to make it happen. Shot there. And 
continues to pepper the body. Nice counter right hook there. He's throwing bombs. Every time they come into contact, he is throwing bombs. Takedown defense holds up. Big shot lands for both guys. Well, not much of a setup there. Misses with the left hook. Nice right hand. Certainly showing off some good hands here tonight. Oh, side kick. Well done. Stuffs the takedown there. How good is his takedown defense? Oh, big knee to the head. Wow. Oh, and now the underhook, DC. He's got the underhook, he's got the far side hook. If you're the opponent, you have got to get out of here. Well, champ, I don't see that well, but it's hard to miss the redness underneath that elbow. A lot of bodily investment from his opponent tonight. Yeah, it's an investment, John. It may not pay dividends right now, but the more you go there, the more damage you do eventually, it will show itself. And right now, it's starting to show. Always busy here in the clinch, lands a nice punch there. Nice jab. Minute and a half to go in our opening round. All right, so look at that. A cut has been opened around that eye area. He's taking... Oh! Oh! Counter jab snaps the head back. That should get his attention. We got to whip his hip into that kick. Well, no denying that he rocked him, but couldn't quite get the finish. He hurt him real bad, but he couldn't find the shot that would put him to sleep. He threw a lot of punches, but he couldn't get the one to land on the button that would end the night. Looking to land the leg kick now. Oh, nice takedown defense. Oh, left hook to the head and dropped. And above the eye. Trying to establish that jab once again. 20 seconds to go in round one. He's going after the head. Final seconds here of round one. Stuffs the takedown. No problem. Oh. Round two straight ahead. Oh. All right, that's the end of the round. You see the cut on his forehead. The blood is trickling down. So we'll see if that becomes an issue or more of a factor here later in this fight. Almost ready to go. Okay, this round, I want him out of there. All right, so there's the end of the round. And on one side, thrill on the other agony after that knockdown. Yeah, he was able to really damage him with that big punch. You see the hands, the speed, how sharp he is, how technical he is. It allows him to land in spots where his opponent is winging punches. Great strike landed. Great punch landed to put his opponent down. You ready to fight? Ready. All right, round two. Oh, the kick landed. Oh, tags him with the jab on the the hook in quickly. Heavy body kick land. So a big knockdown for him in the previous round. Confidence is high and building here in this next round. Confidence is key. And he has a ton of it right now. And there he goes, lands another combination. His cardio is so good that, is, that it allows him to put forth this type of output and pace. When his opponent is done at two, he is stringing together four, five, six more different strikes. You don't do that without having fantastic cardio. Oh, nasty. Oh, flying knee to the head. Just missed with the leg kick. Back 
and forth we go. Oh, roundhouse kick lands. Nice placement there on the left hook counter. Well, this fight's been pretty crazy thus far. Both guys rolling out a lot of damage, and neither seems too bothered by it, but clearly both parties are hurt. Both guys are hurt. Both guys are fighting beautifully. Both are showing a lot of heart right now in this fight. They're both doing amazing jobs. Let's see who gets the job done at the end of this thing. Oh, big elbow. Well, we got a lot of blood now, ladies and gentlemen. I think my mother just turned off the TV, but every time that area gets targeted, that cut is getting worse and closer, theoretically, to the end of the fight. Yeah, and you know, when you got a person like this in front of you that is so good at what they do, when you are bleeding like this and the work is showing, you got to try to find a way to stop them. He needs to try to get a takedown or something because the more he's standing, the more he's going to have to deal with this cut. And now, all the blood that's coming from the cut. Well, he continues to do a nice job here defensively, protecting his head, raising the guard, and really frustrating the offensive fighter a little bit. Lesson one in boxing class, hands up, chin down. Oh, that right eye's looking really swollen now. Looks as though that kick to the body got through. Any body kick may finish this fight. It does not have to be the front one up the middle. Oh, yet again, back to the big kick, and it lands. Straight punch is good. So a much different approach from him here in round two. Took him a while to find the range, get in his striking rhythm. He, yeah, looks a little wobbly on his feet. Seems as if, ooh, gets back to his feet. Oh, huge kick to the leg. 90 seconds now in round two. Takedown defense holds up. And now some separation. All right, so a nice straight punch there after he caught the leg. He decides to punch out as opposed to going for any takedown. Oh, look at the redness underneath that left elbow. He is badgering that left side of the body. Trying to hammer that lead leg. Under a minute now to go in the round. Oh, setting up the left hook, but out of range. Beautiful defensive skill. So you can see some swelling on the facial region now as his opponent lands yet another. Oh! He needs to start looking to finish now because he's got his opponent hurt very fast. Oh, nice body shot. Oh, that right hand barely missed there. 15 seconds remain in the round. Oh, nice. Two rounds in the books. All right, there's the horn. The round is over, but not before he was cut on his nose from the strikes in that round. Back to the stool. Cut man is in. Should be able to shut that cut and prevent it from becoming an issue moving forward. But of course, as soon as he gets struck in that next round, it could open back up. All right, so there's the horn. He got knocked down by a punch in that round, but he is able to survive. We'll see if they can make some adjustments. He's as tough as they come. He took that shot and he kept plodding forward. He got off of his butt. He got himself off of the canvas and tried to get right back to work. But he cannot take many more of these. You don't want to be the guy that's testing how tough that your chin is. You ready to fight? Ready. Go. Round three of a possible five. Well, an appreciation.
appreciative capacity crowd on its feet as this next round gets underway. That previous round get the bonus checks ready. That was insane. It's done. These guys are taking home the $50,000. They laid it all along the line. They dropped a quarter in the middle of the octagon, and they said, let's go. What a round. So wisely, he continues to attack that area that is... Oh, he smells blood in the water. Gotta start looking for the finish here. Oh! And back to his feet. Nice job by the defensive fighters. They're so evenly matched, and they're going to protect. Right back. Beautiful shot lands. Oh, oh, again. oh that cut on his nose. Oh. oh, this one could be over soon. So he's got the body locked down here, DC, or so it appears. This is not a guy you want anywhere near your back. Well, he's worked very hard on this part of his game, and these ground strikes are really starting to take their toll. Side control now, DC. A lot of options at his disposal from here. He's in the mount. Making all these shots count. All right, so he's got the ground and pound game going here. Oh, and he's back up again. Beautiful jab there by champ. That jab is fast. Look at that jab. Oh, an obvious limp there. His leg hurting for certain. Two minutes have gone by. Leg kick. Champ, I'm not sure if it's time to call in the ringside position, but we got a bloody mess on our hands now. Yeah, bloody mess. This guy's almost unrecognizable. Uh, you look at you look at this guy, and you look at his toughness, and his toughness may be a problem right now because his opponent will not let up on him. He's going to continue to beat him up. Clipped him with the right hand there. All right, so the swelling becoming a real factor right now. Did they inject something into his face, or is he just swollen from the strike? Oh, no. Strong, straight left there. Under two minutes now to go in our third round. Single. Well, any time you are in a ground-fighting situation with this fighter, you're potentially playing with fire. Oh, slick reversal right there. That was nice. Now inside the closed guard, trying for a submission now. What a tight arm bar. You gotta be kidding me. How did he get out? He just stayed calm. He was able to withstand the fire, and now he finds himself out and safe. Big right hook there by the champ. Oh, crowd just loving it as the fighters, after an extended grappling battle, make their way back to the feet. Yeah, they're back on their feet. They spent a lot of energy on the ground, though. These guys were going back and forth on the ground, and ultimately, he's gotten back to his feet to give himself an opportunity. Well, it's all pace and pressure down the stretch. He is really lighting them up now. Back and forth we go. Oh, man. That cut is just bleeding like crazy. I wouldn't be surprised to see a stoppage here. So oh, the amount of blood, the amount of blood. And that will do it! Oh, my goodness! Yeah, that was just a gorgeous shot to end the fight right there. I'm not even sure the opponent really saw it coming. So back to the drawing board for him. But for the winner, this is certainly exactly what he was looking for here tonight.
All right, let's get it inside of Bruce Buffer. He has the official decision. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Herb Deans called a stop to this contest at four minutes, 39 seconds of the third round. Declaring the winner by knockout and still the undisputed UFC heavyweight champion of the world, Diesel. So there is the man they are all still chasing in the UFC heavyweight champion, the undisputed king of the big boys, getting it done here tonight by way of the knockout. And his corner is absolutely thrilled with the effort and the result here tonight. He was measured, and when there was an opportunity to seize the finish, he certainly steamrolled right through it. Congratulations to the still UFC heavyweight champion of the world.